your mic for the with the Ram? Yeah, the Ram, sure. Yeah. Okay. Is it gonna uh, be? And that's that thing, that piece of paper. Terry <laughs> has worked really hard for yeah. it. Yeah, yeah. Just, uh, uh, just okay. Yeah, we see that. Sorry. Over there. Alright, let's see. Oh, that's slow. Got it, eh? Really? Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but it was permanent, permanent stuff. Oh, like, well, I thought oh, we'd wash no. out. Yeah, oh. it did wash out. Wow. <laughs> we should have the sun in our face. Oh, that's probably my it's, main thing. It's been. Hi. Thanks. Are you recording? Yeah. You're here. Yeah. Okay, it's still recording. <laughs> also. Certificate, certificate. Show the certificate. <laughs> okay. Hey! Up the back. Oh. 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 Press the red button there. Oh, it's on. Oh. NBA. Yay! <laughs> Thanks, buddy. No problem. Congratulations. Thank you, buddy. I didn't see you inside. I was there. <laughs> okay. Yeah, absolutely. How are you doing? I'm fine, sir. How are you? Hey, buddy. How's it going, man? <laughs> Laughing is all. You know what? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's on? It's on? Ooh. It's on? What am I, what am I supposed to do? Just on a slope. Oh, slow it? Oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> I've got to go down and get my stuff. Okay. Okay, cool. Oh, it's beautiful, eh? Yeah, I don't know. Or I'll just. So it's already on, so you just move it around. Yeah. Yay! You want a guy with flowers? Yeah. You're the pretty guy. The pretty boy. Yeah. Do you want? Oh, I'll edit it later. We'll do all the edits. 
<laughs> Thank you. Great. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Are you guys feeling hot? Yeah, sure. hey, hang on for a bit, yeah. You'll never get this day again. Why would I want this day again? I'm done with it. <laughs> <laughs> Huh? Oh, our reception is in Kara Commons. Let's go. Short clip, sorry. Yeah, yeah of course. Right. It's on, it's on. It's oh. a video. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. You're already taller than me. You look even taller. Yay! Oh, there you go. <laughs> Jerry grew. So this is recording? Yeah. yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah, okay. Right. okay, so how do you feel now that you're done? The red button. We feel how very feel? rich. It's time to make money. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so how much money? Lots. Lots. Millions? Uh, why Billions. stop there? I know. <laughs> yeah, that's good. Oh man, I can't get enough of this. You know? Hey, how are you? Go, man. Okay, see you. No Take problem. care, eh? See you later. Bye. Hello, my name is Murtaza Hirar. I'm the Associate Dean of Research and Graduate Programs at the Tedrogia School of Management. And, um, now, it gives, me, it gives us great pleasure to welcome you here and, and celebrate the also day of Thanksgiving. And I, I give you three groups of people that I think you should consider to be your friends. Some of them are with you, and these are the people who have put up with you. Uh, even when you doubted your abilities and you thought it's never going to get done, that MRP that looked like, oh, I don't right. think I can make it. <laughs> they believed in you, some with love, some with support. You not see them, but they're there to help you. And I, I give you names, like Tega, where's Tega? Tega, so before any one of us know about you, Tega knows about you. He knows where you went for undergraduate. He knows what grades you got. He knows who wrote your reference letter. He knows what GMAT score you scored. And then he becomes your primary champion. He's the first person to know about you in this building. So if I call him at 6 in the evening, even I want this website updated because the information is wrong, he gets that done in minutes. If you have course textbooks in the bookstore on time, that's because of him. If you've got your blackboard set up, that's because of him. So all these people are working behind you. And then, you know, where's Gloria? Hi, Gloria. <laughs> From the time you are matriculated in Ryerson system to the day you graduate, she's the one who keeps you on track. She's the one that tells them, well, this person is not going to graduate. They're missing this, missing that. She's the one who goes through it 
one by one, each and every one of you, their records, and if it happens day in, day out. And these are the people who are working for you, and, and, and the list just doesn't end. Here's Nicole, Nicole Dukeman. You know, I don't see, Nicole Dukeman is, is the person who arranges the MRPs for you, who arranges the external uh, partners for you. She's the one, she and Wayne McFarlane, who go out and, and, and make sure that you have the right interview skills, that you are connected and whatnot. So these are the people working. And then, and then you know, they have Hassan, who's helped you with MRP, Sandra, uh, Jack. <laughs> Thank you. And the three of that he graduated. <laughs> I'm the little one, actually. <laughs> As my, my, my research supervisor, when I was a graduate student at the University of Toronto, and I've known him as my mentor, as, as, as a dean that I report to, and, and, and this is when, I think was the day when he decided that, you know, that's it, I'm going to dedicate my life to research and scholarship, and he did that. And he arrived on this campus, and that time is longer than the time I've been on this planet. <laughs> so, but... We have been talking about over the last few weeks of, of his contributions to Brighton. As you all know this morning that he is retiring. But let me tell you a few small things about him that that you would, would help you understand why and how these people have been contributing or how they have been You're not the big thing, the small thing. After let me tell you, no it's easy, easier or a little better because of it. You know that? Mm -hmm. So one day the dean entered into your cubicles area and said, the air is stuck. This has to fix, be fixed. And right away, you have that big machine purifying air in that room because somebody thought this should be better than what it is. He walked into the room and said, I don't like this carpet. This carpet is dirty. Yeah. And I'm talking about only small things. I'm not talking about the intellectual contribution. I'm talking about small things that matter in your life that the dean did, but you never knew. So he calls Rita and myself and said, look, can we do something about this carpet? And weeks later, we have a new carpet. Then, as my budget catch up here, I cannot support students going to case competition. The dean said nothing like it. We will support, we will send our students because they always bring success to us. And then anytime you do have to go to a competition, all I have to do is can you send them? And his answer is always yes. So join me in a round of applause to Andre Jones, who have done some of them. I would like to invite him to you. It's just a delight to uh, be at these events, and uh, I'd like to acknowledge Jennifer, who is the, uh, the dean of the Yates School of Graduate Studies, and, and Jennifer. Can you hear Oh, she can't hear me. You, that's the first time everyone said that. Uh, anyway, I'd like to acknowledge Jennifer McTavish, the Dean of the Yates School of Graduate Studies, and she works in close partnership with Murkaza, with I, and Jennifer, you've been a great colleague, and uh, you taking over that portfolio for Morris, a good friend, uh, you've done wonderful things, and I know you're continuing to support the, uh, the business enterprise, so thank you on behalf of the school, you've been a wonderful, uh, wonderful co-dean. I don't know what to say after Murtaza. I was the guy in the red suit during your convocation. If you, uh, that's the same red suit. Uh, that's the only suit I can still get into uh, from that time. <laughs> because you'll see I was much uh, much lighter then in, in terms of weight. But one of, that's one of the uh, things of being a dean. Uh, you go to a lot of receptions, you drink a lot of uh, wines, and uh, you eat a lot. And uh, I, I think my wife has told me I've gained 32 pounds since I've become dean. Uh, I think that's one of her... Uh, her promises when I retire. I, I think I'm on all sorts of ellipticals and all sorts of stuff, and uh, I'm not sure. I, I may be back, Dale. <laughs> anyway, it's, uh, all I can say is congratulations. I, I know many of you have been part-time students. That's a very, very difficult thing to do. Uh, I know I got my PhD in, in almost a part-time mode, so I know how difficult that is. You've committed a huge amount of time, and you've had to have wonderful support uh, from, your, from, from your partners, from your spouses, from your families, uh, from your, your children. Uh, you give up a lot of time to, to uh, work part-time and actually get a degree. And uh, I acknowledge that. Uh, we're pleased to have you part of the graduating faculty or graduating students, and uh, we hope you give back. Uh, I'm sure you will. And uh, I'm, I'm pretty confident that you made a very, very good decision in coming to the Ted Rogers School of Management. I, I think the return on investment, both in terms of intellectual capital and in terms of what uh, your future life will be because of an MBA or Master of Management Science will take you forward and it's been a very, very good decision you made. 
I'd like to thank Murtaza for all his work. He, as he said, uh, I, I did have the pleasure of having Murtaza in my research lab for a year or so. Uh, he's, he's a wonderful scholar. He's a committed academic, and uh, he's done a, a wonderful a job in sort of taking the, the master's program and our faculty, I think, hopefully to another dimension. So, Murtaza, thank you for all your work. Uh, and I wish you all well. Enjoy the day. Uh, I have now two other receptions to go to, uh, but this is the first one I came to. Okay, so uh, thank you very much. Uh, I would like to invite the Dean of uh, Graduate Sorry. Studies, uh, Jennifer McCann. Uh, Good afternoon. The sun is shining and you're graduating. You can't get much better than that. Okay? Um, I'm delighted to be here today. Uh, I know how hard all of the students have worked in earning a graduate degree. And I must say the MBA has brought immeasurable pride to Ryerson. Highly accomplished. It really takes down the, the big teams from all over the country. And so we take great in pride in the accomplishments. As you spend some time today, I think it's important to reflect on really the privilege that you've given yourself with a graduate degree. Not many people have access to that, and you know, we often think of these things as sort of a of passage. You, know, you go to university, and you go on and get a graduate degree, much like when you get a driver's license. And it's really not like that. You've invested in yourselves, your families have invested in, in you. So I'd like you to think about that and really celebrate it today. And as you go forward, to use that privilege in a way that shows your responsibility and commitment, not only to yourself and your family, but our communities. Do things that matter, do them well, and have fun along the way. So those will be my thoughts for you. To Murtaza, to Kim, to, to Dale, to all of the team in the MBA, make the MBA a success. I really applaud your efforts, and to Ken, I know we had to lead all in the path to a wonderful future. So congratulations to everyone. Enjoy your day. I would like to now request Professor Kim Bate, Director of the MBA and the MBI program, to say a few words to us. So, one of the great things, one of the great joys in my life uh, is being able to be a part of this program and to be able to work with so many really talented, really interesting, and um, hardworking, uh, wonderful people. Uh, and uh, as we've uh, sort of gone through the last few years together. This is the end of my second year here at Ryerson. I've gotten to know many of you, and it really is a privilege to work with you. Um, it's a privilege to work with Dale. I'm sure many of you um, have sought him out a time or two to have a chat or to uh, uh, talk about things. And uh, Dale is also one of the biggest uh, boosters of the program. His, uh, the program would not be what it, what it is today, the success, without Dale Carl. And um, thank you for being here. So as you're going out into, uh, on with your lives and, and back into the world, or most of you, many of you are now just going to actually be able to see your families on weekends and evenings. Um, <laughs> I, uh, I wish you the very best. Um, I want you to know that we're very, very proud of you and your accomplishments, and um, I hope you all stay in touch, and uh, it's just been a real pleasure and a real honor to work with you. Thank you. Uh, thank you, Kim. And um, in the end, I would just like to uh, acknowledge the presence of my colleagues, professors who have made this program possible. They are around you. You know who have been your, your, your instructor. Thank you indeed for uh, joining us to celebrate the success of our students. This day is yours. Let us not uh, take it any longer uh, to be between you and your celebrations. Uh, enjoy, and we are very grateful that you've been here. Thank you kindly. <laughs> It's on already. Oh. Thank you for all you did for this. <laughs> Beautiful. How do I take a picture? Uh, pictures from your phone. Oh, sure. Okay, great. <laughs> so it's, it's already on. It's, it's camp. So your kids are almost done now, sir? I know. Yes, they oh, are. Good, yeah. sure. Thank you. You're welcome. You press the red button again. Okay. Hey, we're
you have to say something. Yeah. Gary? Say that again. My yes, my yeah. favorite prof. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> He's been saying that to everyone. I know. And everybody's my favorite. I, I, I can't hit I everybody. I love everybody. Yeah. Yeah. I know. He's been saying that to everyone. All right. Cheers. Thanks. Thanks. Folks.